for the leopard was fierce, proud, and forceful. He made a huge drum and he played it every day. Animals came from near and far to see it. It was a magnificent drum, the best they had ever seen, and they wished it belonged to them. Peter Naomi, the sky god, wanted it. A sable, he said. That's a wonderful drum. I should have a drum like that. Will you give me your drum? No! For me, a strobo? Oh, no, a sable. Just looking at fine, he, he cute, magnificent. Ah! <laughs> Last of all, Achi Chevy the tarpon went to get a sable's drum. You haven't got a chance, the other animal said. Not a cheeky little tiny creature like you. It was true. The tortoise was very small, and in those days, her shell was quite soft. She had to watch out that the careless animal didn't squash her flat. Well, I'm going to try anyway, she said. <coughs> looking for me, Auntie Cherry? Not really, a sable. I'm just looking at this drum. Don't you think? It's a fine, huge, magnificent drum, Auntie Cherry. Well, it's all right, I suppose. For a middle-sized kind of drum. Middle-sized? You ridiculous creature. Don't you know it's the biggest drum in the forest? Well, said Auntie Cherry, I've heard that Naomi has got a bigger drum. What? said the sable. Oh yes, it's so big he can climb right inside it and not one bit of him sticks out. Well, I can climb in right inside mine, said the sable. Just watch. A sable began to squeeze himself inside the drum. Am I inside, Auntie Cherry? No, not nearly a sable. No, Auntie Cherry? Not quite a sable. No, Auntie Cherry? Yes, a sable. You're inside, but you can't get out. And Auntie Cherry sealed the drum with a large cooking pot. Now I'm going to take you to the sky god. Slowly, Ashi Cherry pushed the enormous drum with the heavy leopard inside all the way to Naomi. Here is a sable's drum, Naomi, and a sable is inside. Well done, said Naomi. No one else could get the drum. And you have taught that boastful leopard a lesson. Now let him go now and decide what he would like as your reward. Ashi Cherry looked around at all the other animals and they were looking jealous and cross. She thought for a moment, please Naomi, most of all, I would like a hard shell to protect me from all the fierce animals. <laughs> Naomi laughed and gave her a tough hard shell and Achichevi still wears it today. <laughs> <laughs> 